Okay, welcome back to my channel, y'all. I'm about to make some oven tacos. I already prepped the pico de gallo. I prepped it already. The lettuce. I'm gonna make the shells. I'm gonna use turkey. I got cheeses here. And also, um, hmm. I'm also gonna make a cheese sauce. Okay, so yeah, y'all stay tuned for the video. I got my turkey meat in here. Put my onions. Hold on. This is like a half onion, okay? Half onion. A half a pound of turkey meat or hamburger meat. Okay, so turn my fire up. I had on no, because I had to take care of the baby real fast. And over here, I got me some cheese sauce that I'm making. I'm gonna let that cook. All right, so I'm just gonna let this cook. Okay, so again, I have the onion and I'm using a pound of turkey meat. You can also use chicken or ground beef. All right, so let's go ahead and let this cook. And I'll be right back. Okay, so the meat is done. Now I'm going to fry the taco shells. Stay tuned. Okay, y'all. I'm about to fry my shells. I'm, I'm using these um, tacos shells. Yeah. And you can use whatever shells you want to use to fry them. Make your tacos, okay? I only put a little oil in here. And as you can see, that's the oil that I use. I'm going to... I probably have to do one at a time. I got my fork because I like to punch a hole in it. Because you know it's going to... See, do that. There, just take those out. Those, do like that. That's how I do it. And then, I'm going to fold it over like so. But, I'm going to keep it up a little bit. You want baby put your stuff in there, so like that, and then you're just gonna fry it, okay? Like so. I'm gonna go ahead and do my other one, put that in there. Same thing, all right? I'm gonna fry it. I'll probably do like five or six just to have some leftover. Okay, I'm gonna fold it over like so. But keep it open though, keep it open some. Cause you wanna be able to put your toppings in there. So see, like that. I'm gonna fold it back over. Okay. Let's flip it over. See, look at that. Keep it open some, like so. <laughs> and then turn that one over. Well, I'm gonna turn that back over. It's not done. I'm gonna get brown some more, okay? That's not done, okay? So we're just gonna let those two cook. But you see how they look? I just want the other side to look just like that. Let's take a look. Okay, we'll go ahead and flip that one over. And then I'm going to show y'all where I'm going to sit them at. Okay. Y'all probably see already. I'm going to put it on the taco holders right there. Okay, I'm just looking because we don't want to burn them now. Let's see. Okay, cool. Then, let's take this one out. Check this. Let's take this one out. 
Yep. Okay. Now let's get this one. Same thing, like so. So now you have two crunchy, right? Homemade taco shells. Okay, so we have our taco shells here. I got some over there. I only made like seven or six. Okay, so now I'm gonna put these things together. I got my shell. These are the taco sauces. I'm gonna be using the cheese, lettuce, pico de gallo, the meat, and the queso cheese. Okay, so of course I'm gonna show y'all how I'm gonna assemble these things. So I'm not gonna use that cheese over there. Probably not that tomato either. Um, because I got the I'm gonna use this. Okay, so yeah. Let's get started. Okay. Let me get the rest of them. I'm gonna put the cheese down there. Hold on for a second. easy to do it like this okay put the cheese in there put how much meat in yours that you want to put in there okay don't be stingy with it So, like that. Like that. I'm using queso, but you can use like regular Velveeta cheese if you like. Again, I'm just using queso, so. And then we're gonna put these on in the oven and let it bake. So now I'll put these in the oven on 350 for like five minutes. That's it, okay? Because you don't want to burn it. But yeah, so stay tuned for the final results. Okay, y'all. So here it is. This is done. my plate. I'm just moving back so y'all can see it. Okay, my oven tacos are done. I want to actually take a bite on camera and show y'all. But normally I don't do it, but I think I'm start doing that. All right. But anyway, um, let me plate these up, and I'm gonna show y'all again. What it tastes like on camera. Look at all the cheese on there like that, y'all. See, that's why I left the cheese on there when it was wasty. How many y'all think I should do? Two or three? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. There we go. I don't want to break them now. Okay, don't break them. We'll do three on here, okay? Correct. All right, y'all. So, here are the tacos. Let's try one. Which one I want to try? Let's do this one. Okay. Here we go. Ah, super excited. Oh. Here you go. Cheers. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Y'all, this is so good. <clears throat> I want to get my review after I swallow it. Not why. It's good. I can taste the queso. It's cheesy. I got to add my lettuce and my pico de gato on there. But it's good. And then the uh, shells is very crunchy. Because, again, I made it homemade. So, yeah. Um, I hope y'all like this video. Stay tuned for more videos. And please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and come back for more, more, more videos. And stay prayed up. Keep y'all first. Read your Bible, say your word, and just pray, y'all, because we have to pray. And I thank God every single day. Anyway, talk to y'all later. See y'all soon.